Breakfast is the most important meal of the day. Who else was told this growing up? Here's another one for you. Milk is good for your bones and teeth. Both of these messages have been fabricated by a marketing team. And in today's video, I'll tell you about their origins. Hey everyone, my name is John Covey. For the last two decades, I've been working with agencies, coaches and small business owners, helping them get more leads into the business, helping get more customers, and ultimately helping them to grow their business. Remember to click the subscribe button so you don't miss more content about ways for you to grow your business. Okay, so let's look at the first statement. Breakfast is the most important meal of the day. Let me introduce you to John Harvey Kellogg. You kind of see where this is going. He co-founded the Kellogg company selling breakfast cereals as a healthy and essential part of the morning routine. This popularized the idea that breakfast is a crucial part of your day. Next is the milk, it makes your bones strong. The milk is largely consumed in Europe where surprisingly most cases of broken bones and bad teeth are also reported. How is it that a part of the world that consumes the most milk also has the highest reported cases of bad teeth and broken bones? You guessed it, because the milk campaign was created as a marketing message and can you guess who created it? Farmers, in order to sell more milk. And if you dig deep enough into you know, most of the things that we hold dear, they've all been created as marketing campaigns. Love was created to sell more cars. The tradition of proposing with a diamond engagement ring was largely popularized by a marketing campaign launched by a diamond company. The modern image that we have of Santa Claus as a jolly red suit wearing guy was largely shaped by Coca-Cola's advertising campaigns in the 30s. The Michelin Guide, originally created by the Michelin Tire Company in 1900, was a marketing strategy to encourage more people to travel and consequently use tires. When you learn to market well, you need to sell less. If you're good at sales, it's possibly because you ain't that great at marketing. And if you're good at marketing, well, people come to you. So the takeaway from today's video is to find a way to put your message across in a way that moves people emotionally, that shows them that you understand them and clearly outlines the benefits. So this week's question, tell me about one of your favorite marketing campaigns. Was it clever? Was it emotional? Was it something that was just really, really great? What makes it great? Share your answers in the comments. Also look out for the link in the comments where you can sign up for my newsletter where around 4,000 people get my five minutes to five email every Monday at 6.30 a.m. Finally, look out for some more videos popping up on the screen you know, here and here where I share more tips for ways for you to get more leads and ultimately grow your business. Remember, hit that subscribe button so you never miss a video and get the latest tips on ways for you to grow your business. Till next week.